Coffee is killing your sleep. Many people don't realize this, but the half-life of caffeine is six hours, which means that if you have a cup of coffee at noon, six o'clock at night, you still have about a half a cup of coffee in you. That being said, people metabolize caffeine differently. Sometimes people metabolize it very quickly. Other people, it takes a bit longer. If you take a black coffee, typically that caffeine is gonna hit you harder and faster and there's gonna be a bigger crash than if you add some type of fat, like cream to that coffee. Fat in the coffee will slow gastric emptying or the emptying of your stomach down into the rest of your intestines. And so that will slow the absorption of caffeine, it can extend that. What's nice about doing that is that you don't get that massive peak and then that big crash. The problem is that it can extend the action of caffeine over long periods. One of the ways in which caffeine works is that it decreases adenosine levels in your brain. Adenosine is a compound that builds up in your brain to signal sleepiness. And so it drives that back down, making you feel more awake and more alert. If your coffee is too late, if you metabolize it slowly, or if you take it in such a way that causes you to metabolize it slowly, it could be affecting your sleep in a way that maybe you're still passing out, but you're actually not waking up rested. I recommend that if you're having difficulty sleeping and you think caffeine might be part of it, I don't actually love going cold turkey because then you can get a bunch of problems with uh, withdrawal, headaches, feeling like crap, irritability. I recommend that if you really want to experiment with this, try cutting your caffeine intake by about 50% for a week or two, assuming you get no symptoms. Cut it by another 50% after that, and then just keep doing that stepwise every couple weeks until you're back down to nothing or a very low level. Try to concentrate your caffeine use into the earlier part of your day, it might be affecting your sleep many, many 10, 12 hours later.